Get in there, Donna. Oh my god. <laughs> Yeehaw! Howdy, partner. Howdy, partner. Here in Sisters, Oregon, the rodeo here is a really big deal. They have it every year. If you go into town, there are a ton of signs for the rodeo. It was packed. And I'm in this cool little camping area. I'll put the GPS coordinates below. Five bars for a cell signal, four miles to Sisters this direction, about 20 miles to Bend that direction. But you can see here behind me, like there's a camper back there. And I'm gonna go around here, my trusty camera guy. Hey, Doug. Hello. Is gonna show you like there's a camper over there, and then I'll show you our spot. It's hard to imagine that this free dispersed camping boondocking area is right next to a rodeo in town, and it seems like you're in the middle of nowhere. But when the rodeo happened, this place was completely taken over by people. In fact, about a week early, there were semis bringing people's fifth wheels in here and they would dump the fifth wheels and put their own caution tape around them and, and mark off big areas for their friends and by about two nights before the rodeo it started to get really crowded it got a little bit crazy well people are coming for the rodeo and it is Sunday and it doesn't start till Wednesday so it should get pretty packed in here That is a shit ton of fire what a truck just dumped off for these people. And there are a lot more people coming. Donna said she's gonna go eat some of you. Don't you listen to her. Oh, you're adorable. Give a little back to the community. I'd say now this year we paid out over hundred and thirty thousand dollars in scholarships to help kids go to college. So they don't have to ride bulls. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, we know you'd be around on Sunday. Oh my God. Oh my God. Yay, people are leaving. Go home. Go home. Take your generators with you. Yes, and your horses. And your dogs. And your parties. And your teenagers. What else, Donna? <laughs> I don't know. Teenagers were the biggest thing. <laughs> I know. Teenagers were creeping through her campsite last night. I turned my light on them and said, you kids get off my lawn.
This is a beautiful spot. I would absolutely come back to Sisters. It's getting a little hot, so I'm taking off now. Now that it's empty, there's no more people here. But you know, sometimes when I'm traveling, I wish I was seeing more local stuff, and this time I got to do it. So the rodeo was actually pretty fun. If you guys get out to RV part-time or full-time or just get to see the country, it's worth it. You get to see some really cool stuff. I hope you get to do that. Everybody have happy travels out there, and be free. Thank you.